Welcome to Get Up and Get Moving, brought to you by McGill's Faculty of Education and the Department of Kinesiology and Physical Education on the occasion of McGill 24, our university's day of giving. We are proud to announce that our event has been awarded Virtual Sustainable Event Certification by the McGill Sustainable Events Program, run by the McGill Office of Sustainability. This workout has been designed under the supervision of a certified kinesiologist. Those who participate do so at their own risk and should keep their own physical limitations and medical conditions in mind to avoid injury. Hello everyone, my name is Deb Yasmin. And my name is Emma Grace. We're both kinesiology students at McGill University. We're here today to walk you through a short video that you can use throughout the day to stay active. So feel free to go at your own pace and pause the video at any time if you need a break and drink some water to stay hydrated. We will be performing 30 seconds of exercise followed by 15 seconds of rest and we will be demonstrating two versions of the exercise. For high intensity you can follow Emma Grace and for lower intensity you can follow me. Alright, let's get started. Alright, so we're gonna get started with some um, warm up for that first exercise. We're gonna be doing jumping jacks for higher intensity. Again, remember to follow Emma Grace. And we'll get started. And for lower intensity, you can just do it with jumping. Make sure you're breathing regularly. All right. Great job. Next up, we will be doing arm circles. So just please uh, stand straight, have your arms to the side and we'll get started and rotate. For lower intensity, you can rotate at a lower rate. For higher intensity, go as fast as you can. All right, we'll switch direction now. Almost there, keep pushing. Five seconds left, keep it up. All right, next up we're going to be doing high knees. For this exercise, you'll just have to bring your knees as towards your chest as high as possible. We'll get started in three, two, one, go. For higher intensity, you're just gonna be adding jumps to it. For lower intensity, avoid jumping. Bring your knees as high as possible towards your chest. Almost there. Five seconds left. All right, great job. All right, so now we're going to move to the main component of our exercise. So we're gonna start off with ski jumps. So for this exercise, if you're doing the high intensity, you're gonna jump to the side, take another jump and jump on the other side. For the low intensity, we're just going to take steps in place to each side. All right, so we'll get started in three, two, one, go. And make sure to swing those arms if you're jumping. And when you land, bend your knees, grab that force. Almost there, 10 seconds left. And we're done in three, two, one, and rest. All right, for the next exercise, we will be doing uh, courtesy lunges for this exercise. You will bring your foot diagonally behind you and then Bring your knees down as you lunge this way, like you're sitting on a chair. We'll get started in three, two, one, go. Make sure when lunging that your knee is in line with your foot and it's not going over. Make sure you're alternating between your legs. All right, 10 seconds left, keep it up.
Okay, we're finishing up in three, two, one, and rest. All right, we're now going to move to the side to side punch out. So for this exercise, we're going to keep our feet in place for the low intensity, and we're going to punch to either side, turning our torso. For the higher intensity, we're going to add a step forward when punching. All right, we'll get started in three, two, one, let's go. Make sure to take a big step forward if you're doing the higher intensity version. Almost there. And we are done in five, four, three, two, one, and rest. All right, for that, we will be doing lateral shuffles. For the high intensity, you're gonna shuffle to the side this way while bending your knees a little bit. For the lower intensity, we will just do lateral steps without hopping, but with the higher intensity, you will be adding the hop. But we will get started in three, two, one, go. Make sure to keep your back straight and really just focus on alternating your feet. Almost there, five seconds left. Three, two, one, and rest. We're almost done. We're gonna do some squats now. So for the higher intensity, once we do our squat, we're gonna come back up and then we're gonna jump. For the lower intensity, we're just gonna squat. All right, we'll get started in three, two, one, go. Make sure that your knees are flexed back to your feet, and it's really like you're sitting on a chair. Also make sure your back remains straight. We're almost there. We're done in three, two, one, and rest. Great work. We're gonna go to the cool down now. Take a breath. So for our cool down, we're gonna start off with a big breathing exercise. We're gonna put our hands neutrally like this. Take a big deep breath in. Deep breath in. Hold it, stretch, stretch, stretch. And exhale. You can let your arms go. We'll do that another two more times. Want to get once again, breathe in. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Exhale. Very good. One last time. Big deep breath in. Hold it, and exhale. Very good. Now we're going to do a bit of a stretch for our legs. We're going to grab one leg. So feel free to grab something if you need that extra stability. And we're just gonna stretch that leg muscle. And we'll hold it for five, four, three, two, one. All right, we can let it down. Do the same with the other leg. Hold it up. And we'll hold it for another five, four, three, two, one. Great job. Our last stretch of the day. We're gonna take our right arm. We're gonna bring it across our body, kind of to tap the back of our shoulder. And if you wanna put a bit of pressure with your other hand, you can do that. You'll just wanna feel that stretch in your arm. We'll hold that for another five, four, three, two, one. Great work. And we'll do that one more time with the other arm. So now take your left arm, bring it over your shoulder, hold the back of your shoulder, 
and push a little bit that right hand. We'll hold it for another five, four, three, two, one. All right. Great work, everyone. That's it for this workout. We hope you enjoyed yourself and you're as sweaty as we are. All right, thank you for watching. Thanks so much and don't forget to be active. Bye. That's a wrap. Thanks for joining us. If you enjoyed your workout, please consider supporting McGill's Faculty of Education by making a gift today at mcgill.ca slash education hyphen giving.